Prince Noctis! Yeah? Prince Noctis, were... Were you excited to marry Lady Lunafreya? Because she was really excited to marry you. She looked so happy the day her dress arrived. She really loved you, Prince Noctis. I... <sighs> Thank you. At first, the father had mourned the fate of his chosen son. Yet in Tenebrae, the two found solace. It was not the Oracle who assuaged their fears. But the girl, she holds the true power. I have little to offer a king other than the voice afforded the Oracle. Nevertheless, and I'm afraid you might find this foolish. But to be together with Noctis again, even if only for a short while, it would mean the world to me. I do not seek to guide him, merely to stand beside him. Lady Lunafreya worried she was burdening you with the wedding. That's not true, is it? No, not at all. I sincerely apologize for the inconvenience. How long are we to sit and wait no more? Lady Luna Freya once tended a garden filled with Scylla blossoms, watering the flowers herself. Sadly, the whole field went up in flames. Uh, it's heartbreaking to see what's become of it. So you're Lady Luna Freya's fiance, right? Wanna know something? Okay then. Everyone knows she liked pretty flowers, but you want to know what else she liked? Cool stickers. It has to be true. Ready to depart. Just swapped out the damage cards for some new ones. Give one of us a holler when you're ready to shove off, then. Dining car's open. If you need a break. on your minds. Take a look at the menu. No 
Okay. We'll see you around. Shall we shove off then? Climb aboard. Don't worry about the civilians. They're in my good hands. Can't say the same for you. Watch yourselves in the capital. We will. <laughs> Thanks, Arne. We'll see you around. It's... snowing. Get your ass on board! Yes, sir. 